Hey guys, it's Riles. I'm back at you one more again. If this is your first time coming to my channel, thank you. Namaste, love, and light to you. And thank you so much for your support. And please like and subscribe. Hit that notification button on either side, whatever side it comes on. Hit that notification button so you know when I'm about to upload my next video. Um, if you are returning sub, thank you for the support. Love and light and namaste to you. Today in my video is about Twin Flame 101. Our life is limitless. Limitless. I always thought that was a weird word growing up. Limit. <laughs> I used to always joke about that. Limit. But anyways, I love that word though. But it's actually good. Oh, it always made me think about that movie they came out with, Limitless, and I think they even have a TV show. I don't know, like I told you guys, I don't really watch TV too much. But um, today I'm listening to my dad's song. It's the instrumental karaoke version of Sign of the Times. So I was just like, I love this version because even though I love this song, it's one of my favorite songs. You get rough and raw with it, it's keeping it 100. But this is the actual instrumental version so it doesn't seem like I'm yelling too much over the words and stuff like that kind of ruins the song a little bit but you know sometimes you know you guys know I'll, I'll put one of my dad's songs in my videos and sometimes I'll just put a uh, meditation video or whatever and you guys are like what videos do you push whatever I feel like putting on that day but um it made me think about uh our life is basically the way they put movies out is just like basically somebody either experienced this or they heard about it and treated them or whatever. But whatever. It was just like we they, that guy takes a pill and basically he can do anything he wants to. You know, he's able to run a thousand yards or whatever. He was able to work this job. He was able to learn, go to a different, you know, country and able to speak fluently and stuff that he didn't really know nothing about. And it's like we had that pill. Everybody has that pill. It's instilled in their mind. It's just we only use a certain percentage of our minds. And it's just sometimes it's just like the fears and the things that we set upon ourselves that's either been told to us or it's just like people just really don't support us on believing it. Or we even sock ourselves out because we are our worst enemy. I am my worst enemy because there are sometimes I done self-sabotage myself just because of my mouth. I don't self-sabotage myself. That's why I'm very mindful of, on the things that I project to you guys and the things that I say out in the world. But um, it's just like some people have came to me and asked me why, you know, why you want to make these videos? You know, why would you want to talk about something like that? You don't want people looking at you funny or, you know, thinking you're crazy. And, you know, and, I, and that almost put me in a standstill like, oh my God, they might be right. But it's just like, well, why not leave, take that leap of faith and take that chance? You never know. You tried everything else. You know, I went to my mom's school. I went to my mom's hospital where she had me at and called them. You know, I didn't went there. You know, I didn't go there, but I actually called. But um, that, that's how determined I was. I, I went to, you know, a, a long lost family from TLC signed up with them to see if they can find my mom, you know, and it would have just been perfect, but it was just like everything I had to go through, you know, meeting my dad's ex-wife, meeting his band members, um, I had to go through all that, you know, seeing how much, you know, the extended family of different people from different walks of life loves my dad, me getting through, that was my way of healing, making these videos is the way I heal. These videos started off of me trying to reconnect with my mom, thinking somebody will see my story and just like, you know, they, it'll just so happen. They, oh my God, you know, this is your, you know, your daughter. You know, I think this is your daughter, you, you know, you've been telling us about or something like that. You never know what my mom's been saying about me, you know, ever. I always wonder, you know, did she ever think about me or whatever. But my determination on being home on wanting what was taken away from me and my father, I know I had to take that back. So I had to think outside the box. I had to drop all my fears and worries about what people thought of me or what people might say or whatever because it's like things I go through on a daily basis, having to deal with my family and dealing with home things. And, you know, it was a lot to deal with. And I know that that was my determination on I had to better myself. I had to think outside the box. What do you do next? 
what do you do? What do you, you know, you got to do this, you got to do that. You know, I reach out and I do this. I reach out and talk to, you know, try to talk to people that, that know my, you know, that knew my dad at the time and they spent time with them and all that stuff. And, you know, I did everything I needed to do. And it might not have gotten me exactly where I wanted to be at that exact moment, but these people know about me. This is like these videos that I, you know, that I, I push out to you guys about all this positivity and love and trying to better yourself and make a better version of yourself. You know, it, it brought me to a different thing of like, this is something I love to do because it's just like when you're at a job and it, it makes you feel like you're at a job. This is just like, how many things am I going to come up with, you know, for, uh, you know, what, what am I going to come up with my latest video? Or, you know, it's just like when I see the comments that I get. And, and the views that I get. And, they, you know, before it used to take me like to get 100 views within a, about a week and a half to two weeks. Now it only takes me about two or three days. And even though I'm not getting a lot of views like with some of some of the people that are getting on YouTube, they've been doing it for so long. They, they, they sub they did a lot of stuff that's like I've tried to get on live feed and I cannot do it to save my life it's like I can download the program but it's just like my computer and stuff is not working with me so I just don't know guys I've actually tried it and I don't know you know like there's sometimes I can go down my list and it says you know Rosalind got live stream and I'm like okay I, I've been trying to get on my live stream and can't get on to it but it's just so difficult so I gotta find somebody that knows how to do this stuff or whatever but it's just like the things that I try to tell you guys. It's just like while I'm trying to better myself, I want you guys to better yourself. Think outside the box. There's things that you want to do. There's I don't know what you want to do. You know what you're going to do. The only thing I can do is while I'm guiding myself, I'm helping guide you too. Because the things I'm doing is really working. Like I, I can go out and I can go to the grocery store or whatever. Next thing you know, I see a little red Corvette. And then I'm just like, okay, I need to slow down, think about it, because it's not going to last if I keep doing this. You know, and it's just like, you know, I, I get the different signs. It's just like certain songs I can be listening to a thousand times. And then when I actually hear the lyrics to it and put meaning to it, I'm just like, wow. Okay, like a lot of the songs that I'm picking, like a lot of movies that I've been watching, it kind of teaches me something. Or the songs that I'm doing is, you know, listening to is teaching me something. So it's just like it gives me ideas. It's just like I get ideas from when I get the comments from you guys. And I, I just, I love you guys so much because you guys keep me so much in my spirits. That's why I always try to make sure I'm in good, I'm in good spirits when I talk to you guys. So it, it's just like do things that make sure yourself happy. Make sure you got a good support system. You got a good support team. Even though you might be going by yourself, make sure you're your own support team if you don't have nobody to help you. You know, because it is just like I, I battled from ADD. I still battle from an OCD, uh, manic depression, um, and it is just like dealing with all that stuff. It, it can be hard at times, and it's just like, if you would actually know me, like, really know me past the videos, you would just be like, girl, God bless you, and you know you got something good going for you, it's just like, so many people, it, just now, just for you knowing a little bit of things that you know about me, you know, it, it, it's just like, I've been through so much, and it, it just has made me into the person I am today, and I love the person I've become, that my pain has has brought me a testimony to something I can tell you guys about and it's just to let you know. Yeah, we go through things and we, we experience things in our lives that can be so detrimental and so heartbreaking. But do not let that stop you from where you need to be. And it's just so many things I have stopped. I could have been doing stuff a long time ago. But it's just the family that I had around me and the things that I've done that I can accept my own consequences because of my actions. But it's just the people around me that did things. I wasn't able to experience things. So, um, 
And it's just like I can see my dad shining upon me and just saying, you know, I'm just so proud of you. Because it's just like I look at my videos and I pat my whole self on my back. And I'm like, girl, you are doing good. And it's just people are telling me, you know, you enlighten me. You know, it, your videos are very interesting and very entertaining. And I, I don't want to be all monotone. Because I, I don't seen some YouTube videos and I'm not putting out no names. Oh, my gosh. And they can really, they really are good a good youtuber but if they just change that they change that 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 tone in their voice because it's like hearing nails scratch and i'm just like oh my god i can't take it if you just change that tone a little bit because you're all doing it on tone and it gets annoying but you know they'll, they'll catch on every now you know they'll catch on one, one day but it's just like, I know I can't really talk about nobody because I don't get my stuff done too long. I, I got some things that I need to do. But that's the reason why it's just like I can make a video. And I'll probably make it about 20 times just because I want it to be right. I want to be able to make sure I send the right message out and y'all get what I'm trying to say. It's just like, dang, she's really making sense. In case if I didn't tell you guys, I'm listening to instrumental sign of the times. I really love that song. But, no, it, it's just like like that that movie the guy takes the pill and he's able to do anything and we're able to do anything we want to if we just open up our right brain and get outside that box step outside our comfort zone and not be scared about what people say not what people think if it's about the greater good more power to you i will support you i support anybody that's doing anything to better themselves to make a better person if it's to go out to hurt somebody or trying to you know make a fool out of somebody i, I don't know uh -uh. No, <laughs> I just don't deal with that. But I, I'll, I'll be straight up with you. I, I just don't have time. I am wearing my little comfortable shirt because it's getting kind of cool. Our temperature just finally dropped because it's been like in the last few weeks, it's been like in the 80s. If it's not been raining, it's been like 80, 90 some degrees. And I'm like, this is in October. It feels like it's November. It's starting to feel like November. So I'm like, oh, you know, I can pull out the little, you know, the little fleece. And the, you know, the little, you know, little warmers or whatever, the little plaid and, you know, little Ugg boots and the jogger pants and stuff like that. I like to be comfortable. But, yeah, guys, it's just like, we not think outside the box. It's just like when people ask me when I start doing these videos. I don't know if I mentioned that, but I know I did this video about three times. So, forgive me if I'm saying something again because I don't know if I said it in this video or not. So, forgive me if I'm saying it again, if I sound redundant. But, um... It's, it's just the fact when people ask me why did I start doing these videos, it was just first off just reconnect back to my mom and my family and stuff like that because I was desperate. I didn't know what else to do. You know, I went to my mom's hospitals. I went to her schools, you know, trying to call and see about, you know, what where her whole name was, where her address is, where did she come from, you know, I had a lot of the other stuff, but it was just like, I needed bits and pieces, I already had like where she stayed at and stuff like that, but I didn't even know where she moved to, but they really couldn't tell me that, but they can tell me some, certain things that I already had that they wouldn't do to get themselves in trouble, put it that way. But it was like, I was so determined to get through that, and it's just like, people were like, God, dog, you are really determined, yes. I need to get home. It's just like the family I deal with, it, it's just like I love them, but I had to love them from a distance because it was just too much pain. And it was just like I knew something had to be better than this. I knew family life had to be better than this because I've seen so many families that were out with their families and, you know, going out to eat and, you know, just doing certain things with their, you know, their parents that I wasn't able to do with mine. My, my family thought that was perverted. I couldn't do it unless it was with my stepmom and stuff no so I just couldn't do that but it was like everything that I went through whether it was good or bad especially with the bad it really pushed me to do what I needed to do because everything that was going around me I had to heal and it's just like these videos helped me heal this videos where I know where I'm getting I'm getting these comments and it's just like you know some people are trying to downplay it oh well, you only got 17 views or you only got six views it don't matter to me you know, these people might have, you know, 10,000 views or whatever. But, yeah, look at the contents that we're talking about. They might have a twerk it challenge, and I'm sitting up here talking about love and life. 
So, you know, that, that makes it gives you a big difference on how people's mindset is. They want, instead of them talking, worrying about meditating and something to better themselves, they might want to see somebody shake a little boom boom. So, you know, I don't think about stuff like that because it's just like out of those seven people, I know you never know those seven people might tell seven more other people and then bring 15 more other people back just to watch what I had to say. So it, it doesn't really matter to me because it was just like when I first started, I remember getting one or two views and that would last for like about a week and there'll probably be about three or four other ones and I would get discouraged, but then I start looking at different videos and they were encouraging me, like, you know, you have to start off from somewhere. If things are not going to be easy, don't think you're about to get what you want overnight. Because if you do, it's not going to last. It's not. So you want that foundation of where you're going to have to get bump scratches. Go through that battle and fight. Because once all this is over, you're going to look back at every little thing that you went through and all that hell that you had to raise and all the hell you went through and just be like, it was worth it. Now I look back at everything I went through and I, I mean, yeah, I'm just like, now I'm just like, certain things irritate me, but I'm okay. Because then I look back at all the things that I went through and how I used to handle it. I used to handle it worse off than what I do now. I might, you know, fuss a little bit and then I'll be, you know what, just think about it in a different way. Because you might not like where you're at right now, but just look at it in a different perspective. It's giving you time. To practice on work you know it, this right here is just like when i get all my positive comments i might get a dislike or whatever it's okay i might have three dislikes but i've got 60 likes out of all the three likes dislikes so i'm okay with that you're not gonna please everybody not everybody's gonna like my videos and that's okay too they all they gotta do is just shut it off that's just so simple you ain't gotta pay attention to it you don't gotta you know you don't gotta be at you, you get aggravated by the things i say shut it off that's all you gotta do. But it's just things that I do. I try to better. I'm bettering myself. I'm healing as I'm going through this process. You know, I'm being a better person, knowing, you know what, you're gonna go through hell. You're gonna go through this slow, snail process. You're gonna feel like you're stagnant because all the things that you're going through, look at the magnitude of the blessing that you're about to get. So I'm gonna go through this hell. And it's gonna be worth every bump and scratch and cry and tear that I that, that drops from my face. And I, I just know that everything's going to be straight. But I'm not trying to hold you guys up. But just think outside the box. If you, you know you want to better yourself. And there's things that you need to change. Change your surroundings. Change your way of thinking. Change, change the way that you go about things. It might do better for you. As I am doing the same as I am practicing what I preach. And I will talk to you later. Much love and many blessings. Please like and subscribe. Hit that notification button. And I pray for you. Love and light. Namaste. Peace. And be wild.